NVIDIA Noise Removal is now available as a free VSD plugin that you can use in your DAW or video editing software. So let's check it out. Now, if you create content in a room that doesn't have a lot of acoustic treatment, you know that echo and other noise can be a problem. And if you like to vlog and walk around outside, there's always background noise to get rid of. Now, of course, apps like OBS Studio have built-in integration that we can use this to get rid of the noise while we're recording or streaming. But if you come back with some footage on your camera, you want to deal with it later on, sure nice to have a VST that works in your video editor or in your DAW. So today I'm going to show you how to get this installed. It's really easy. And then we're going to test it out using Premiere Pro as well as Persona Studio One. Now you can probably see I've left a shotgun microphone in frame here so you can see just how far away it is from my mouth. And I've set it up that way because I want to capture as much room noise as possible so that when I process the audio later on using this free plugin, what you hear in this video is going to be what you can expect from this free VST. And remember, NVIDIA noise removal only works with RTX 20 and 30 series cards. So if you don't have one of those, unfortunately, this isn't going to work for you. So to get started, go to the NVIDIA SDK download site, links in the description below, and go over to the audio effects and you'll need to install the SDK. And note that there's an RTX 30 and 20 series version, so make sure you download the right one. Once you have that done, we'll just go ahead and install it. Now go ahead and double click to install the file. Now I'm going to stop things there because I already have this installed. And then head over to the Elgato website at the link I have below. Then go ahead and scroll down until you get to NVIDIA Noise Removal and choose Download. After a quick sign up, you'll be able to download the Noise Removal plugin. It's again a free VST. And then double click to install just like we did with the SDK. Now, just like any VST plugin, the first time you go into your DAW or video editing software, you may have to scan for changes or it might happen automatically. But once that's done, it'll be all set up and ready to use. All right, and I've opened up Premiere Pro here and I've loaded up a sample piece of footage that doesn't have any noise reduction. So it's going to have all the room noise. I'll let you have a listen. All right, so I thought I'd record a short clip here so we can see just how good the NVIDIA noise removal works in this free VST plugin. So you can probably hear I've got the fans ramped up on my computer, got no noise reduction, no other plugins running here on the microphone. Now I've got a vacuum and I'm going to turn that on beside me. Well, so you get the idea. There's a lot of noise here. Now, since this is the first time, what I'm going to need to do is go into edit and I'll choose preferences and audio. And again, this is for Premiere Pro only. If you have a different video editor, it might work a bit different. So you have to go into the audio plugin manager and scan for plugins, and it'll go ahead and find that new VST plugin. Once that's done, we can close this out. And then it's just a matter of being in the effects tab. And if you go in there and you type NVIDIA, you'll see that the NVIDIA broadcast noise removal now comes up as a VST3 plugin. So we just take that, of course, and drag it onto the clip. If you use Premiere Pro, you'll be familiar with this. And now it's going to show up as an effect. And if I open up the panel, you see that it's a pretty straightforward panel here. We've got either on and off, and then we can adjust the strength. So again, typical settings here, no different than what we'd see in OBS Studio. They just created a bit of an animation. So I'm just going to put it on full. I won't go spend a lot of time with this because you already know how this works. But I'm going to go ahead and set it on full. It's applied to the track. And I'll just go ahead and I'll render this out and we'll listen to the difference. Okay, so I've gone ahead and I've loaded up that rendered footage out here. So I've overlapped the two so we can have the audio before and after here in Premiere Pro. So I'll start off just soloing the first uh, sound without the processing. All right, so I thought I'd record a short clip here so we can see just how good the NVIDIA noise removal works in this free VST plugin. So you can probably hear I've got the fans ramped up on my computer, got no noise reduction, no other plugins running here on the microphone. Now I've got a vacuum and I'm going to turn that on beside me while I'm... Okay, so we all remember that. Now I'm going to go ahead and play back the newly processed with NVIDIA noise removal. All right, so I thought I'd record a short clip here so we can see just how good the NVIDIA noise removal works in this free VST plugin. So you can probably hear I've got the fans ramped up on my computer, got no noise reduction, no other plugins running here on the microphone. Now I've got a vacuum and I'm going to turn that on beside me while I'm speaking. Might as well do the full test here. And of course, this is a pretty extreme example. And NVIDIA noise removal isn't going to do anything more in the free plugin than it would do with the regular use through broadcast but it gives you at least another flexibility to use it after in post. And now I brought the audio again here over into Studio One, and it's as simple as adding an insert. If we go to insert, we could just type NVIDIA, and you'll see it comes up right away. 
we can add it it's now an insert on the track and we can apply whatever strength we want just like any other plugin and while there are plenty of noise removal plugins that you can use in post to clean up your footage it's nice to have the option to use one that takes advantage of gpu instead of cpu and I have to say it was really great of Elgato to step up and release this free VST plugin for everyone, regardless of whether you own any of their products. And if you're looking for other ways to level up your audio in post, check out one of these videos.